Thanks for joining us on Indivisible with John Stubbins. I'm your host. We are here from CPAC 2023. And as always, this is the show where we put God, family, and country first. And we will always tell you the truth. I'm here today starting off with Kimberly Lowe. Kimberly is running for Senate, U.S. Senate, in the great state of Virginia to take out Tim Kaine and finally drive him out. Welcome to the show, Kimberly. How you doing? Thank you. Thank you for letting me be your first interview. We're Waiting thrilled to have you. And why not? When in the state of Virginia, you gotta, yeah. you gotta go with the home team. Tim Kaine's gotta go. Gotta go. Right? Been in for way too long. He's part of the swamp. Hillary Clinton's vice president. Pick. Right. Right. And what has he done, or not done, I should say, for the great state of Virginia? Tim Kaine's done nothing. Our families are suffering. Our families are being destroyed. And this has been occurring for decades across America. And I know that I can help save our families in America. You know, it's it, it, it drives me crazy because I remember when he was running with, with Clinton and all I could think of was uh, gag. I mean, the guy made me sick. He had nothing to offer. I mean, he was he was just a complete despot. Just where, who is this guy? It, it, and it seems like the Democrats do this Every cycle, they come up with these idiots. Like, you're like, who is it? Kamala Harris, for instance. Nobody liked Kamala Harris, yet she gets in as the VP. It's, Give it's me a break. So disrespectful to women across America to have her as a vice president of our beautiful country. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, and here's the thing. Doesn't Virginia deserve better? I agree. Yeah. There's way too much that has to be fixed and worked on. And we need spunky non-politician real people in office to go fight that are tough american people with thick skin i'm seasoned i've been in politics for a long time and i'm still standing i've had horrible global and national media stories done against me i've had the department of homeland security come after me if you are telling the truth in this country the government will come after you we are not Free. No. Freedom is over. But I, as a single mom and farmer of three kids, I'm not going to stay at home on my couch when our country is being lost. That's right. We are at the last hour in America, and we need fighters to show up with real policy solutions. I've been collecting advisors for years, uh, so that way I'm ready to walk in and take the job and have actual policy solutions to problems. Yeah, and you know... We use the term fighters loosely, but I want to I want to expound upon that for a second, Kimberly, because look, we're not looking for just any old fighters. We're looking for brawlers. You want to step into the trenches into this war? This is not for the faint of heart. Okay? We are in a battle. We are in a war. It's personal. Right? When they start attacking your finances, when they start attacking your way of life, your ability to do whatever you want to do as a free American, your rights in general, whether it's guns or birth rights with this abortion nonsense or the border or critical race theory, forcing out of your throat. Look, what is most important? If you had to name three, what is most important? Is it crime? What's Is it CRT, BLM? What's most important to the state of Virginia right now? Government abuse, which is destroying our families and people, not making it a free country, so you're losing your constitutional rights, your First Amendment, your Second Amendment, your due process, everything that affects your living. You're, you end up losing your children in yeah. your home because of an abusive system. The economy... We yes. can very easily be energy independent again. We can fix our logistics system of shipping and transport with a lot of quick fixes. Yes, yes. Um, there's so China, what um, China's doing to us right now, inexplicable. It's inexplicable. Well, I spent an extensive amount of time at the Texas-Mexico border I've even trekked cartel trails. I've been in places where people come into holding where most people don't come in. And that's trickling into Virginia. 
we are losing so many people because the opioid epidemic that right. has to be solved. And there's right. a lot of policy that can change this. I, this race is so important because I would be a swing vote. I would love everyone to step up behind me because I am a fighter. I'm not going to sell rainbows and unicorns. I'm going to stand up for the American people. You can find out more about me at www.kimberlylow.com. And Mike Lindell is doing a fundraiser for me. And John Michael is going to be speaking as I well. can't wait. Can't wait. May 13th in Richmond, Virginia. Go get a ticket. Show up. You want to volunteer? You can volunteer from your couch to save this country with me. Stand behind me. Help me win this seat. It's the swing vote. Yes. And I can't wait to be there on May 13th. I was just getting ready to talk about that event. That's actually my birthday. So it's going to be twice the fun. Uh, I get to introduce my friend, Mike Lindell, who sponsors my show. We're, we're very excited to be there. And I've got some good friends in Richmond. Uh, in fact, uh, my friend Leon Benjamin ran for Congress out of there. I think District 4, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, so maybe we'll, maybe we'll talk to Leon, see if he'll show up and... Uh, and join us over there. But again, May 13th, give that website again one more time. www.kimberlylow.com. You can get a ticket there. You can donate there. You can contact me to volunteer from your couch. You can do something for your country and step up. That's right. And everybody, you know the website for this show. It's johnstubbins.com. If you have any information you want to get in touch with Kimberly, don't hesitate to send me an email or go to Kimberly's website direct and where you can volunteer and you can get involved. Thanks for joining us and we will see you soon.